My freshman year, we had the Vivaldi Four Seasons solo recital, and it was to showcase the freshman violin students. Normally, this never happens. We don't have opportunities to perform or like a solo recital to ourselves, which comes in our junior and senior years. But with this, we had a goal to work towards, and we had something exciting to give to our peers, who are all our upperclassmen. So I happened to be in charge of coordinating that with Kathy Brown, who is wonderful. Um, I put together the program notes and sort of oversee, oversaw the moving of the harpsichord and the stands and everything for the dress rehearsals. I don't think I performed again until I came back for grad school. And then it's almost like I started to take advantage of Powell. <laughs> we did um, an early music ensemble concert that I was involved in. Uh, we did another recital of a student who just happened to book the rotunda. And uh, finally, we, as my quartet, booked the rotunda and did a full recital of just us. The, the rotunda has stood out as one of the highlights in terms of a performance venue and a performing experience. It's the built-in acoustic of the rotunda. So it really attracts a lot of musicians because it, you step in, you play a couple of notes, and you realize that you just entered like a church from the old world. It has that, that nice reverb time. It has the really cushy um, auditory response from from playing chords, from playing with a group, from playing solo. It's really like a nice, cushy space to be able to perform. Everything sounds better out of the instrument, which is nice. Points of advice are to not be scared of the librarians. They're very sweet. To take advantage of the resources in terms of um, the research center here, the librarians that know this library like the back of their hand, um, and really the wealth of knowledge in the single people, not just looking online. Go to seek out the help from someone else. You develop your people skills and you gain access to this wealth of knowledge that you might otherwise not even find because you just don't know how to find it. Projected career path <laughs> is um, sort of a childhood dream of playing in uh, a very large symphony orchestra. So one of the large ones now would be LA Phil, New York Philharmonic, Chicago, um, Cleveland Orchestra, something like that. But as a kid, I had always dreamed of playing in the LA Philharmonic, and that's something I'd really like to do. On top of that, there's, I am passionate about chamber music and um, student teaching, trying to pass along the knowledge that I've received from the fantastic teachers here at UCLA. And um, I think as long as music stays a part of my life, I'll be okay. <laughs>